Okay, I admit it. I'm the one who buys the giant bag of tea lights from a certain Scandinavian home store. But hey, there are a hundred of them for under four bucks. And then I forget to use them. But that's all about to change. Because today on the Tamara Twist, we're gonna shed a little light on shade. The Tamara Twist, a lifestyle show with an emphasis on the lighter side. With segments from food, to travel, to crafting, to home. <laughs> Candlelight makes everything look better, but this is a craft about making the candle look better. It's a wine glass lampshade. I'm always looking for projects that are fast and fabulous, and all the better if they're inexpensive as well. This one hits the trifecta. Our first design uses vellum, which works perfectly for this project because it creates a soft glow. I've designed a template which you can download from our website. First step, trace and cut out your shade. I like using white on vellum, just because I think it looks pretty. Of course, you can use whatever color you like. To make a cute little border, a flat pencil eraser does the trick. For a richer, deeper design, make sure that your pigment ink and your embossing powder are the same hue. Now, connect the ends. I like to use decorative brads, but it's just as easy to use double stick tape. See? Cute, right? If you want a really simple version, just cut the shade out of pretty scrapbooking paper like this one. For added sparkle, apply crystal accents to the paper. Here's a tip. Don't buy colored crystals. Buy the clear ones and then use permanent markers to color the gems whatever color you need. Be careful with the sparkle gems. They can get out of hand. Here are some variations using all different kinds of wine glasses. For a more modern look, this one is on an old fashioned glass. No stem needed. You can also make themed or holiday shades. Now, where did I put my wine? Ah! Huh. For more information, visit us at tamarascentral.com.